Now this Fox 6 exclusive, a Racine County man is badly injured in a hit and run crash. He was riding his bike when a driver struck him last week. Ashley Sears joins us now with the victim's message of forgiveness. Stephanie Charles Sparger was on his way home from work when he was hit in the town of Paris. He had several broken ribs and bruising. Tonight he says he's grateful to be alive and he's not angry at the driver who hit him. I survived. I'm healing. I need to, and I'm going to move on. Around Charles Sparger's home, there are a lot of thankful faces. The father of six has been counting his blessings after a close call. I'm very grateful that I survived. I'm more grateful because I didn't want to leave them. As he rode his bike home on Highway 142 in the town of Paris last Thursday. I was headed down the hill, making good time was struck by a vehicle. And then I looked, somebody woke me up, and there was a bunch of emergency personnel. The driver took off. Oh, Sparger suffered broken ribs and bruising, and his trusted bike was busted. It's how I get to work. It's basically freedom. He was taken to the hospital and released days later, grateful to be alive, but concerned about what happens next. He started a GoFundMe page to pay for medical expenses and to buy a new bike. Sparger is visually impaired, and it's his only way to get around. So ultimately, that bike is freedom and self-reliance for, for me to get to work, to make a living, to help my family survive. He's asking the driver to come forward. If they don't take that responsibility, they'll hurt someone else. And they'll continue to hurt other people, and they'll hurt themselves. This victim is not angry, but looking for peace, ready to forgive. Vengeance and anger isn't worth it. The Kenosha County Sheriff's Office says the hit and run driver may have been in a late 90s Chevy Silverado with front passenger side dam damage. Anyone with information is asked to contact the Sheriff's Office. Stephanie. All right, Ashley, thank you.